Hi, Jeffrey Funk here. Uh, I'm going to talk about another kind of power hammer, one that you may not have seen before. This is a triple-headed 75-pound hammer. There are three 75-pound air hammers here with different die configurations so that, especially in working thin material, I can go from one to another quickly without losing my heat. This hammer is, uh, you know, the third generation of a whole long series of power hammers I've been making. Um, and, and it uses plastic guides, two and a half inch air cylinders, and a single very heavy plate that so one anvil is able to, to uh, be useful to three hammers on a smaller footprint. I've got separate control for each one. The valves are electrically controlled, except the throttle valve is mechanically controlled. We'll look at the valves shortly. Main power is on, and each hammer can be individually put on. I'll put them all on. Some air. This is it. All those, all those hammers are ready to go right now. control your stroke on a power hammer. And here I've developed a way of doing it very easily. While it's running, I can put it, I can go from a low stroke to a high stroke. So when I don't have iron in there, so I'm not going to strike the dies. But it's very convenient. There's a small knob in here, you can't see it on the video. This is the back side of the machine. Oh. Um, and you can see the bearings for the treadles, the return springs and a series of cables that run the throttle valves. So I had to use cables because I had to get all the way around the hammer. And here is the throttle valve, the throttle valve and the main valve. The main valve is the blue one which is electrically controlled. The throttle valve is this brass one. Conventional boiler, filter, and all the air goes through one half inch line. I'm going to do some deep throwing on X to isolate a mass. I'll come here. Instant. Very, very controlled. I can neck that out. Now, if I want to make it wider, I can come to this one. And if I want to make it longer, I can come to this one. by how tender this is. It's a 75 pound hammer and it's really quite strong. So that was one heat, one hammer.